It looks like Tesla Giga Berlin is not going to use a pile foundation. Welcome back, friends. This is Armin Haryan from TalkNews.com. Today is Saturday, and I'm on June 6, and I'm going to talk about something that we haven't talked about before. We have in the past we have talked about Tesla testing piles to see the pile foundation, and we know that Tesla was given permit recently to start the uh, the foundation work, and Max Bogel company has been doing the foundation work to uh, dig the foundation. Just just before the uh, ground groundwater but it looks like tesla has after testing 19 piles it looks like as you can see in these pictures from tobias lind and our friends that tesla is not going to use a pile foundation i don't know i am not a foundation uh, expert but uh, it looks like tesla is using a shallow foundation let me know what you think about these things huh these concrete foods uh, are footings are huge uh, do you know any idea of what they may be if they really want to pour concrete into this they need to they need a lot of concrete mixes so maybe the tesla is going to build a shallow foundation not a pile foundation i did little research and found out that you know shallow there are two different systems of foundations in construction one is called shallow foundations one is called the, the second is called deep foundation pile foundation pier foundation and case and foundation are part of this deep foundation but shallow foundation is a way to do the isolated spread footing or wall footing or combined footing or cantilever or strap footing or raft or mud footing but what is foundation first foundation of a construction of a gigafactory is one of the essential parts of the structure it is defined as the part of the structure that transfers the load from the structure constructed on it as well as it weights over a over a large area of soil in such a way that the amount does not exceed the ultimate bearing capacity of the soil and the settlement of the whole structure of the gigafactory remains um, within a tolerable limit foundation is the part of a structure on which the building stands the solid ground on which it resists is known as foundation bed okay uh, foundation should fulfill the following objectives distribute the weight of the structure of a large area of soil so that's what tesla is doing right now distributing the weight of the structure of future um, tesla gigafactory over a large area of soil avoid unequal settlement prevent the lateral movement of the structure and increase structural stability now types of foundation one of the types of foundation is called shallow foundations as the shallow foundation depth is low and it is economical it is the most popular type of foundation for lightweight structures several types of shallow foundations um, are discussed below like you know isolated spread footing wall footing combined footing cantilever of strap footing raft or mat foundation uh, let me know friends do you think this is an isolated footing uh, i don't know but you know the images that i'm seeing in some construction websites looks like this is an isolated footing which is this is the most widely recognized and most straightforward shallow foundation type as this is the most economical type they are typically typically utilized for shallow establishments to convey and spread concentrated burdens caused for instance by pillars or columns they are generally used for ordinary buildings now if any one of you are in construction business and no types of foundations what do you think by just looking at these images from tesla does this look like tesla is going to use pile foundation or does this look to you like tesla is going to use shallow foundation you know um uh, isolated foundation these images were just taken today uh, this morning in germany and also i wanted to uh, you have been seeing the train that um, the tesla has been using trains to bring gravel to gigafactory every day and uh, you can see this picture uh, these uh, the trains pictures that you have been seeing are from our friend jurgen and who has been showing how the trains are being loaded and unloaded bringing um, gravel to uh, unloaded being bringing gravel to gigafactory so i want to thank you our and thank our friends jurgen albrecht and tobias for providing these images on saturday these images and videos for us to share and the main idea is that it looks like tesla is switching from 
pile foundation to shallow foundation to build its first European gigafactory where it hopes to and plans to roll off the uh, build the first model European model Y which will uh, which is expected to roll off the assembly lines next July of 2000 uh, July of 2021 okay friends have a wonderful day let's continue the discussion of in the comment section below like I said yesterday Tesla's Giga Berlin factory is perhaps one of the best documented uh, industrial settlements in the world because uh, including Torque News YouTube channel and many other channels and uh, as well as our friends uh, here that I mentioned from Grünheide are helping us to chronicle and document Tesla's Giga Berlin building every day and there are lots of you guys who are watching this and listening to us which we appreciate if you are here for the first time please subscribe to this channel because this is a developing story we bring Giga Berlin updates daily and um, ring the notification bell so you don't miss the our next report and please like this video to show your appreciation of our friends from Grünheide who have been helping to uh, document Tesla's Gigafactory every day at Torque News at this Torque News YouTube channel. This is Armin Haryan from TorqueNews.com. Friends have a wonderful rest of the day. God bless you and I'll see you soon in our next report. See you soon.